While Chu Xiong was drunk, Zhuang Bai rarely told Chu Xiong's embarrassing story. Chu Xiong once met a female practitioner named Xiaoling during a mission. Chu Xiong fell in love with Xiaoling at first sight, but Xiaoling didn't like Chu Xiong. However, because Chu Xiong is so powerful, Xiao Ling will also take the initiative to invite Chu Xiong in the following missions. This also made Chu Xiong mistakenly think that Xiao Ling was interested in him. Later, Wang Chongjiao appeared and performed the mission with them. For some reason, Ling finally became husband and wife with Wang Jiao. So Chu Xiong always had a problem with Wang Chongjiao and often complained about his hatred for seizing his wife. Zhuangbai said with a smile, actually, this guy is the third party. Miss Xiaoling and Wang Chongjiao are actually childhood sweethearts and have made an engagement long ago. After this incident, I guess his anger should have subsided. Lin Moyu looked at Chu Xiong and really didn't know what to say. The quarrel lasted for a long time, and the so-called five, two, and three-inch hatred for seizing his wife was all Chu Xiong's wishful thinking. However, based on Lin Moyu's understanding of Chu Xiong, this guy looks careless, but he is actually very thoughtful. I guess I already knew it, but I just couldn't let go of it to save face. This matter will not be mentioned again in the future, just let it float in the wind and scatter in the stardust. Chu Xiong was drunk for most of the day, and he didn't wake up until the game was over. After waking up, Chu Xiong remained as usual. Lin Moyu and Zhuang Bai had a tacit understanding and did not mention anything about Wang Chongjiao again. There were no big surprises in the fifth round. Among the 15 people who finally won, 12 of them were players numbered 2 to 13. Counting Lin Moyu, players number 1 to 13 are all in the top 16. Among the 13 people, 3 are from the Divine City and 2 are from the War Temple. The remaining eight people came from the recommendations of the four major star domain masters. While proving their absolute strength, it also proved that the vision of the four territory lords was not wrong. The remaining three players, numbered 18, 19, and 21, respectively, are also low-numbered players. If divided by star region among the top 16, three from the Suzaku star region are Lin Moyu, Yubi, and Chu Xiong. The Azure Dragon Star Region occupies four seats, and the White Tiger Star Region and the Xuanwu Star Region occupy two seats each. After the game, Su Jianqing also came over. Looking at his appearance, he seemed slightly nervous. The round robin will start tomorrow. Although we don't know the specific method of the round robin yet, everything still depends on strength. Among all the people, Su Jianqing is weak and will inevitably suffer a loss. On the second day, all players received a reminder from Renhuang Network. The round robin competition will officially start in one hour, please be sure to be careful. Until the start of the round robin, no one knew the specific rules. Preparation is also difficult. Lin Moyu took out several true god realm magic weapons and gave them to Su Jianqing. They were not swords or other magic weapons. Su Jianqing had no shortage of such magic weapons. What Lin Moyu gave me were magic weapons with strange functions. For example, one magic weapon is a small sword, which has no offensive effect. His function is to suck his own blood and then turn himself into a human being. In the bloody state, he can be immune to most lethal damage, while his own attacks are not affected. This is a good auxiliary magic weapon but its duration is very short, only one minute. There are several messy magic weapons like this, which Lin Moyu left behind because he thought they were fun. In his eyes, they are just toys, but they can be used in some places. For example, the concentric rope, Chu Xiong relied on it to easily defeat Wang Chongjiao. Some magic weapons can be of great use when used at the right time. As for how Su Jianqing uses it, it depends on him. The most useful one is a jade tablet, which can hide one's breath. Although the jade tablet is only a magic weapon in the true god realm, once used, it is difficult to find it in the god king realm. Zhuang Bai looked at what Lin Moyu sent and had some speculation in his heart, Junior Brother Lin, do you have any guesses about the rules of the round robin? Lin Moyu said, it's a little bit, but it's not necessarily accurate. 
Su Jianqing's eyes lit up as he listened, Senior Brother Lin, it doesn't matter if you say it. Naturally, Lin Moyu will not give in. With so many people competing in a round-robin competition, it is impossible to compete one by one. I guessed from the beginning that the round-robin tournament would lightly simulate a battlefield. Since we want to simulate the battlefield, we naturally have to simulate various situations. So I think the round-robin competition is most likely to be a team competition, or a brawl, or even a combination of multiple methods. This can test your actual combat capabilities, adaptability, and team assistance capabilities. Then we will make a comprehensive score based on your performance. It is precisely because of this that Lin Moyu gave Su Jianqing these magic weapons to be prepared. Su Jianqing admired Lin Moyu 10,000 times in his heart. Lin Moyu seemed to be able to guess many possibilities as long as there were some clues about anything. This kind of ability is absolutely unmatched by me. He became familiar with the magic weapons. If it was true as Lin Moyu said, these magic weapons would be very useful. An hour later, he was teleported into the arena. Lin Moyu, Zhuang Bai, and Chu Xiong began to watch the round robin match. Their round of 16 matches will begin after the round robin, but the rules have not yet been determined. The round robin also has a great reference effect for them. Large forests, lakes, islands, and glaciers appeared in many arenas. Stars appear in the sky of some arenas including cold ice stars and hot stars, bringing about different environmental changes. Some arenas have even turned into a world of lava. Different terrains appeared on different arenas. But a unified standard is that there are four gates around each arena. No one knows where the door leads. Nearly 500 players were teleported into different arenas. There were 5 to 10 players on each arena, and the numbers were not equal. At this time, Renhuang Network finally announced the round-robin rules. The round-robin rules are as follows. Everyone's initial score is 100 points. Everyone aims to defeat their opponent. The winner gets 1 point and the loser deducts 1 point. The loser will be randomly transferred to another arena. Each arena has a different environment and a different number of players at the same time. Players can also enter other arenas through the portals around the arena. Players can form their own teams and join forces, and the points obtained will be divided evenly. If the points obtained are less than 0.5 points and 2.5 points, no points will be obtained. If the player thinks he is defeated, he can admit defeat directly and will be randomly transported to other arenas. The rest of the restrictions are the same as during the arena competition and must not be violated. Duration of round robin, 30 days. Note, the arena is not safe, please do not stay for a long time. Looking at the rules one by one, many people became confused, and for a while they were not sure what they meant. And some people with keen reactions have fully understood the meaning of circulation and integrity. At this time, Su Jianqing was truly convinced, which was not much different from Lin Moyu's guess. Senior brother Lin is so awesome, he can guess all this. Don't worry, just follow what junior brother Lin said and analyze the rules. Only by clarifying the rules will you not suffer any disadvantages. You have 30 days to take your time. The rules are very clear, but there is also some other information hidden in them. One of them is that multiple people can join forces, but after victory, the points gained need to be divided equally. No points will be awarded if the score is less than 0.5. In other words, at best it would be two people joining forces. If three people join forces and defeat someone else, none of the three will get points. The key is here too. The rules do not clearly define joining forces. What counts as joining forces? For example, he was in a big fight with someone and was about to win. At this time, someone stepped in and participated in the attack. Maybe it was just a slight touch, does it count as joining forces? If it counts. Su Jianqing had some strange ideas in his mind. You can also voluntarily admit defeat and you will be directly and randomly teleported to another arena. This operation can prevent yourself from being injured. 
When you know you are outmatched, it is better to admit defeat and wait for the opportunity. One last tip, don't stay too long. Thinking of this, Su Jianqing immediately started to move. He didn't know what the consequences would be if he stayed for a long time, but since Renhuang Network had said the rules, it was best to abide by them. Su Jianqing was currently in a jungle, with towering ancient trees, some weeds taller than people, and dense thorns. It is not easy to move forward in such a jungle. 23. There are no restrictions on flying at this time. As long as he flies up, he can get a better view. In this environment, vision is very important. But after Su Jianqing thought about this, he did not take off. He still kept moving and moved forward cautiously in the jungle. After a while, he finally saw other options. Su Jianqing recognized him. He was player number 399 from the Xuanwu Star Territory. He was stronger than himself in terms of strength, and because of his outstanding defense, Su Jianqing had no confidence in killing him. Su Jianqing put away all his aura and tried not to be discovered by him. Contestant number 399 flew over his head. Not long after flying, suddenly a law turned into a sharp arrow and shot out from the ground. The arrow was very fast and penetrated his body. With a scream, contestant number 399 fell from the air. It is indeed dangerous. Su Jianqing's heart trembled. There was indeed danger. Fortunately, he was not flying in the air. At the same time, his eyes were shining, staring at the direction where the man fell, there is a chance. He quickly sneaked over and took out a jade plaque and stuck it on himself. The jade tablet concealed his aura and his movements. Su Jianqing found him soon. He was leaning against a tree and was treating his injuries. The wound is not small, but not fatal. But it seems that he is temporarily unable to move and has lost his combat capability. A long bow appeared in Su Jianqing's hand, he drew the bow and shot the arrow in one go. The man didn't expect a sneak attack at all, and by the time he reacted, it was already too late. Su Jianqing's sharp arrow pierced his heart. The man screamed and disappeared. Defeat a player and get one point. Su Jianqing received a prompt from the Human Emperor Network. He is not worried about actually killing the other party. Since the Human Emperor Network allows them to do this, it naturally has ways to control it. A minute later, contestant number 399, who was attacked by Su Jianqing, appeared in another arena. Renhuang Network treated his injuries and most of his injuries were healed, but not all. But at least there was no problem with movement, and it would take him an hour at most to cure it. Asshole, which bastard attacked me, don't let me know, otherwise I want you to look good. He yelled curses, and began to treat his own injuries. The round-robin competition began, and the entire human race, all major star fields, all galaxies, and most people's attention were focused on the competition. Not long after the game started, people encountered each other and started competing. Some were sneak attacked, some were assassinated, and some were defeated head-on. The points began to change, and the rankings on the leaderboard also changed accordingly. Everyone's initial score was 100. At this time, Su Jianqing got one point and ranked in the top 10. But with his strength, he will eventually fall. After all, his realm is not enough and his strength is a bit inferior. Zhuangbai chuckled and said, Junior Brother Lin's guess is really accurate. It is indeed a combination of multiple competition systems. Lin Moyu smiled, guesses are just guesses. In the end, it depends on Junior Brother Su's judgment and response. But it seems that Junior Brother Su is very smart and has grasped the key points in the rules. Chu Xiong scratched his head, this rule seems to have a lot of twists and turns, and it's a lot to think about. Junior Brother Lin, please explain it to me. Chu Xiong is not stupid, he just doesn't like to use his brain. He can also be said to be lazy. Lin Moyu did not refuse, first of all, the rules say, defeating the opponent, not killing, etc., which shows that the rules have changed. But this conflicts with the restrictions of the knockout rounds, so you need to control the speed yourself. 
God King Realm magic weapons definitely cannot be used, nor can soul attacks, nor can they kill people intentionally. But in fact, the rules have been relaxed. I think it will not be a problem to severely damage the opponent. Junior Brother Su has grasped this. Zhuangbai chuckled and said, Yes, Junior Brother Su shot an arrow through the opponent's heart just now. It would definitely not work in the knockout round, but obviously it can work here. Lin Moyu continued to explain, The second point is that the portals around the arena can go to other arenas, which gives the strong players the opportunity to move to the arena, making it easier for them to get high scores, thereby widening the gap between high and low scores. The third point is that when players think they are defeated, they can admit defeat and they will also be transported to other arenas. For the weak, this is a kind of protection to avoid injury. For the strong, it means spending one point in exchange for saving a lot of time. Chu Xiong was stunned for a moment. You mean, even if you don't meet a strong person, you can still use this method to change the battlefield? Lin Moyu nodded, it should be possible. The fourth point is, no more than three people can join forces. There will be no points for three people joining forces. Two people joining forces will each get half. The efficiency may not be 480 higher than that of a single person, but it will definitely be safer. But you can team up with three or even four people, and only two people will take action. This way you will be safe and gain points. But this rule also gives sneak attackers an opportunity. You can attack others when they are about the same. You can still get points, and you don't have to actually take action. Chu Xiong was stunned again, would it be despicable to do this? Zhuangbai answered for Lin Moyu, there is nothing despicable on the battlefield, everything is for the purpose of victory. There is nothing that cannot be done. The arena is a lightly simulated battlefield. On a real battlefield, there shouldn't be too many sneak attackers. The last point is to always keep moving. Once you stop, you will be attacked by the formation. Also, don't move around. The arena is not safe, and you will be attacked if you don't do it. I think there should be many traps in the arena. In fact, these can also be exploited. If you can make good use of the rules, even if your strength is insufficient, your ranking will not be too bad. Chu Xiong felt dizzy when he heard this, why are there so many twists and turns? It's really a headache. I hope our game won't be this round robin. Zhuangbai glanced at Lin Moyu and said, if we have a similar competition, junior brother Lin's opponent will definitely be miserable. Lin Moyu is too smart, and he uses the analysis of rules to the extreme. It is very painful to become his opponent. Lin Moyu shook his head, no, rules have no effect in the face of absolute strength. Lin Moyu said this very domineeringly. The tone is calm, but people have to admit that Lin Moyu does have this ability. Even though Zhuangbai had never seen Lin Moyu attack with all his strength, he knew that he was far from Lin Moyu's opponent. Even if all restrictions are relaxed and all firepower is used, the results will not change. Not only him, but people like Dong Feng Zhe and Qin Fei also came up. In fact, there is one thing Lin Moyu didn't say, that is, although this round-robin match will not lead to real death, it is more terrifying than real death. Even if you are fatally attacked, you will not die, but you can experience the same scene as death. Except for the different results, the entire process is the same. During the 30 days of the round robin, some people may experience life and death many times. If the will is not strong enough, the mind may collapse long ago. If he can persevere, his will will be greatly tempered, which will be of amazing benefit to his future cultivation. This is also one of the purposes of the round robin. It seems very cruel, but it is also necessary. The human race not only needs geniuses and powerful warriors, but also powerful war kings who are fearless in death. The round robin competition is still going on, and the human emperor network controls the formation, simulating the mountains, rivers, seas, sun, moon, and stars. There is day and night, there is a secret realm, and there is a sea of stars. Each arena has its own characteristics. The players shuttled inside, but due to the rules, they could not stay for a long time, so there was no rest time. 
The arena is huge, but Renshaw Network has made it very small. It seems that there is an invisible force that constantly controls the direction of each player. They often meet quickly and then fight. Few people have discovered this. The peculiarity is that the players inside it don't feel anything at all. Only Lin Moyu had a vague feeling that there was a force in the formation, which invisibly affected the soul's judgment and brought the players closer to each other. The authorities are obsessed with this. If you can see this clearly, you may be able to change from prey to hunter. It's a pity. Without a soul in the other side realm, you can't sense it at all. Su Jianqing once again encountered an opponent, whose number was 452, slightly higher than him, but not much higher. The strength of the two is about the same, but Su Jianqing has read the other's information and knows the other's characteristics. After a great battle, Su Jianqing won the final victory. After the opponent was severely injured, he was teleported away by the formation. Su Jianqing did not stay in the store and left immediately. He didn't know how many people were in the ring he was in. Under unknown circumstances, he could only remain vigilant at all times. As the sun and moon changed, Su Jianqing walked for a day and a night and never encountered an enemy again. He opened the standings and took a look. He was ranked 57th with a score of 102 points. When he watched it half a day ago, he was still ranked in the 30th place with the same 102 points. Half a day later, he had dropped to the 57th place. There were bursts of white light flashing ahead, and then he saw a portal. Unknowingly, he had arrived at the edge of battle. He didn't know what kind of world was behind the portal, but he knew what he should do. After taking a deep breath, Su Jianqing walked into the portal. My ears heard the sound of fierce fighting, which was the roar of law and the child of magic weapon. The line of sight was restored after 0.1 seconds, faster than any previous teleportation. Su Jianqing saw two people fighting fiercely. The two people knew each other. One was number 288 and the other was number 311. They were both stronger players than him. Su Jianqing took the jade token given by Lin Moyu and hid his aura far away. During the period of hiding, Su Jianqing still kept moving, but the movement was very small, and his attention was always watching the battle between the two sides. Player number 288 gradually gained the upper hand and was about to win. At this time, Su Jianqing carefully shot an arrow of law, which passed through the air silently. It merged with the attack of contestant number 288 and shot into the body of contestant number 311. The arrow of law only has the true god realm and has almost no damage. It was never discovered from start to finish. Until contestant number 311 was defeated and was teleported away, Su Jianqing received the prompt from Renhuang Network at the same time. Defeat player number 311 and gain 0.5 points. Su Jianqing's heart, which had been tense for a long time, suddenly relaxed, and then he retreated silently disappearing without a trace in the blink of an eye. Player number 288's angry roar came from behind. Someone actually intercepted him halfway and took away his points. He opened the rankings and saw the changes in points. Su Jianqing's 0.5 points were particularly eye-catching. Su Jianqing. I can't spare you. Angry roar spread throughout most of the arena, and Su Jianqing had already run far away. Outside the stadium, countless spectators saw this scene, and they all couldn't laugh or cry. One of the deities slapped his thigh and laughed, this guy named Su Jianqing is a talent. He actually used the rules like this. Even I didn't expect it. Nonsense, he comes from the Su family in the sacred city, do you think he can be different? No wonder the Su family in the sacred city. The Su family is very strict with its disciples and has cultivated a large number of talents, which is really good. These rules are full of pitfalls. People who can take advantage of the rules are smart people and will definitely achieve good results in the future. What Su Jianqing did seems to have inspired some people. That 0.5 point change makes people think a lot. 
Some people think that he has joined forces with others, but they feel that it is wrong. Contestant number 288, from the White Tiger Star Territory, has Sue signing star and eight poles that can't be reached. Soon some smart people figured out why. There are more and more things being done according to the method, and many people have to pay attention to whether there is anyone hiding in the dark during the war. In another arena, Ching Xiaoxiao controlled a magic net to trap a person tightly. The man looked like he was tied up and couldn't move. Ching Xiaoxiao's big net is a magic weapon at the peak of the true god. Although it cannot tie people up for too long, two or three minutes is not a problem. Ching Xiaoxiao didn't make a move, she moved left and right without stopping. The person tied up in the big net is a cultivator from the Xuanwu Star Territory, a ninth-level god king, with strong defensive power. Although Ching Xiaoxiao tied him up, there was nothing she could do about him. The man shouted loudly, Ching Xiaoxiao, you can't touch me at all. Let me go quickly. I'll pretend I've never seen you. Ching Xiaoxiao shook her head, no, I want to earn your points. What a waste of money, you can't even beat me, what's the point of spending it like this? The man continued to shout, but Ching Xiaoxiao was very determined and went her own way. Two minutes later, a sharp arrow suddenly shot down from the air, passed through the big net, and seriously injured the man. The man's defense collapsed amidst the screams. Ching Xiaoxiao easily went up to hit the target and won directly. Taking back the big net, Ching Xiaoxiao giggled. I am still smart and know how to use the rules. It's a pity that Lin Moyu is not here, otherwise I would definitely want you to look good. Sooner or later, I will tie you up into a rice dumpling and beat you up. As she spoke, she clenched her teeth and waved her fists, looking like she wanted revenge. At this moment, the sound of breaking wind sounded, and a sharp sword appeared silently behind Ching Xiaoxiao. Someone made a sneak attack and their combat power was not bad. Ching Xiaoxiao reacted very quickly and dodged quickly. The man missed a single hit and retreated directly, disappearing without a trace. Ching Xiaoxiao couldn't find anyone and was so angry that she was in chaos. The players gradually adapted to the round-robin competition, and various fighting methods began to appear. Sneak attacks, assassinations, bargain hunting, traps, everything. The cultivators from the four-star domain showed extraordinary combat prowess in the round-robin competition. Compared with the cultivators in Shenqing and Ares exhibition, they have richer combat experience and stronger on-the-spot adaptability. They tend not to be fond of fighting. They fight if they can and run away if they can't. Even when faced with a dangerous situation, he will choose the behavior that is most beneficial to him. On the other hand, those cultivators in the Temple of War and the Divine City believe more in their own power and are more willing to fight to the end. Such a spirit is certainly good, but on the battlefield, such behavior is really seeking death. Unless there is a situation where you really cannot retreat and you must fight to the death, otherwise you need to respond flexibly. Everyone knows that this is experience. Cultivators in the four-star region perform various tasks all year round and often go to the battlefield to fight against alien races. Many people have wandered on the edge of life and death and accumulated a lot of practical experience. This is something you can't get from practicing in seclusion. As Lin Moyu said, the round robin is not just about strength, experience and luck are both important. Unless you have the strength to crew sh everything, the balance will always tilt. The rankings are constantly changing and as they add up to the round robin, the rankings change more and more frequently. Another thing happened to Lin Moyo. Ren Huang Network seemed to intentionally line up people with close numbers together. Although it is not all, it is the case in many cases. In this way, we can find out who is the real strong one. When the round robin reaches the tenth day, the top ten on the ranking list have basically been established. The points of the top 10 are far away from the others. The highest ranked player is the player number 19 named Jiang Gang. He comes from the White Tiger Star territory, and his offensive is fierce, not much worse than the cultivators from the Azure Dragon Star territory. Originally, he had a chance to enter the top 16, but unfortunately he met a small temple from the War Temple. 
his points reached 372 points, and in just 10 days, 272 people had been defeated by him. He seems to have a special talent for finding targets quickly. Every time he goes to an arena, he will find the opponent in a very short time and defeat him quickly. Then go through the portal and go to another arena. This talent of his is useless in one-on-one -on -one combat, but on the battlefield, it is a great weapon. Several people ranked below him also showed extraordinary combat prowess. Su Jianqing's ranking gradually dropped due to his strength. But because of the various magic weapons given by Lin Moyu and the deliberate control of the Human Emperor Network, the enemies he encountered were never much stronger than himself. His points have been increasing slowly. Ten days later, his points have reached 121 points, ranking 230th. At this moment, more than half of the people have less than 100 points. Not only did you not gain points, but the basic 100 points were removed. The most unlucky one has less than 50 points. In these 10 days, he was defeated more than 50 times, which was extremely miserable. Lin Moyu suddenly realized something, his eyes flashed with intense light. It turns out that the round robin competition has another purpose, it can tell a person's luck. Luck is a part of strength. Sometimes, good or bad luck can determine life or death. Xiaoxing once had very bad luck and almost died. But his luck seemed to have improved again later. He met me and escaped death. Lin Moyu was thoughtful, seeming to have some deep understanding of the elusive thing called luck. Time passed day by day, and on the 21st day of the competition, the first elimination was produced. Only then did people realize that cyclic harm would also be eliminated. The eliminated person is the one with the worst luck. His points were deducted and reached a negative number. He became the first to be eliminated. In the next few days, people who were eliminated continued to appear. The number of arenas seems to be decreasing, and the scope is also getting smaller. The range of activities of the players is getting smaller and smaller. The frequency of encounters is getting higher and higher, and the intensity of the round-robin competition is also rapidly heating up. With five days left, hundreds of contestants have been eliminated, and only four seats are left on the stage. With more than 300 people crowded into four arenas, the probability of encounters increased significantly. And the rules have become stricter. If you don't move for more than one minute, you will be attacked by the formation. At this time, the effectiveness of the trap increases significantly. It does not need to be a strong trap, as long as it can trap the opponent and make it difficult for the opponent to move within a minute, it is enough. Wait for the opponent to be injured, then add the finishing blow yourself, and score easily. Reasonable use of rules is very important. Under this scene, Su Jianqing's life became even more difficult. Not only him, but all players with insufficient strength have gradually become targets. In the final analysis, strength will ultimately speak for itself. In the last few days, people continued to be eliminated. Soon the last day of the round robin came, and there were only just over 200 players left. The arena became smaller again, and everyone was teleported into the same arena. This day will determine the final ranking. Jiang Gang is firmly ranked first, and no one can shake his position. Even Qing Xiaoxiao is no match for him. The rankings after him have gone crazy. They fought wildly to win the final points. The last day of the 30-day round robin is the most exciting part. This day is also the most stressful day for the players. If you are unlucky, you may die dozens or even hundreds of times in a day. Every time we face life and death, it is a huge mental torture. Although he knew he would not die, the feeling of terror when faced with a fatal attack would not change in any way. For players with high numbers, it is time to hide and not be discovered. As for the players with low numbers, the task now is to find them and defeat them quickly after finding them. The jade token in Su Jianqing's hand played a huge role. He hid underground and relied on the jade token to hide himself without being discovered. Finally, the round-robin competition came to an end in a fierce battle. 
The formation roared, teleporting everyone away, and the ranking was determined at this moment. The first place is still Jiang Gang. He ranks first, with a high score of 1200 and is unshakable. In the last few days of the round robin, it was the peak period for him. The second place is Qing Xiaoxiao, her score reached 986, ranking second. The next few people were very tight on points, and everyone worked hard on the last day. On the last day, two-thirds of the remaining 200 contestants were eliminated. It can be said that points will only accumulate to a few people in the end. Su Jianqing was very lucky. Taking advantage of the characteristics of the Jade card, he was only found three times. It was Jiang Gang three times, and Tian Pai couldn't escape Jiang Nan's talent. In the end, Su Jianqing successfully passed the round robin with 102 points and 132nd place. When Su Jianqing came back, his face was slightly pale and he looked frightened. It's not a good feeling to be killed. It wasn't until he drank more than half a bottle of wine that his face turned rosy again. Chu Xiong patted Su Jianqing with his big hand, you will get used to it if you go to the battlefield a few more times in the future. Su Jianqing shook his head, Yi Zhang feels different. It's indeed different. It's not like he has never been on the battlefield. He has also been on the battlefield, constantly going through life and death. But when you actually face death, the feeling of terror is still different. There is great terror between life and death, it is not just talk. Lin Moyu understands him. When he was in the Tulu world, he narrowly escaped death, even he was scared to death at the time. After this battle, General Su Jianqing will be more indifferent to life and death, his will will be stronger and firmer, and his future achievements will be more lofty. On this day, in the city of Dabi, some people were crying and some were laughing. Some people are extremely drunk, and some people are wandering in the street and going crazy. All kinds of emotions were vented at this moment. After 30 days of competition, life and death, after relaxing, it is not surprising that I have all kinds of emotions. For many people, 30 days of high-pressure competition is an unimaginable test. Some people completely collapsed in the process, while others became stronger and stronger. The most important thing is that there are many subtle changes that will accompany them throughout their lives in the years to come. Su Jianqing was drunk, very drunk. But there was a satisfied smile on his face. He was very satisfied with this round-robin match. He was defeated dozens of times, and if he was on a real battlefield, he would die dozens of times. This is a harvest that ordinary people cannot imagine and is very precious. Zhuang Bai's voice was gentle, it's our turn tomorrow. Does Junior Brother Lin have any ideas? Lin Moyu shook his head, actually, you don't need to have any ideas, just like Jiang Gang. Zhuang Bai chuckled, indeed, as long as you are strong enough, you can ignore any rules. Lin Moyu went deeper, more than that, any rules are for the strong. Don't forget the original intention of the competition. Dobby's original intention. Chu Xiong said in a low voice, isn't the competition just about picking the strongest one? Lin Moyu shook his head, yes, pick the strongest one. But not only the strongest one by strength, but also the strongest one by luck. Zhuang Bai frowned, obviously he didn't fully understand Lin Moyu's words. Chu Xiong is the type who just asks if he doesn't understand, who is the strongest person with luck? Zhuang Bai asked, luck is so illusory, how to evaluate it? Lin Moyu said with a smile, luck may seem illusory, but in fact there are ways to measure it. You can see part of it in this round-robin match. Luck is related to fate, to the future, and to success or failure in life and death. Chu Xiong touched his head and said, Junior brother Lin, you are getting more and more ridiculous. Zhuang Bai also seemed to understand. Although the two of them are already minor gods, their level is still not high enough. I can't understand something as ethereal as luck for the time being. Lin Moyu also came into contact with the law of destiny by chance, and then he had a certain understanding of luck. Lin Moyu said, Senior Brother Chu, Senior Brother Zhuang, you don't have to pay too much attention to luck. This is actually some of my guesses and cannot be accurate. 
and even if it is true, it is already destined and cannot be changed by human power. We can just let nature take its course. In the round-robin competition, everyone's performance is visible to everyone. Each name is remembered by others. These are all geniuses of the human race, and they are all great figures with a promising future. A large amount of faith came from all directions, and everyone had their own fans. But what is more worth looking forward to is the top 16 match on the second day. No one knows what format the top 16 will use and whether it will also use a round-robin tournament. Lin Moyu no longer wants to guess, he will know soon. A loud noise woke up the city of Dhabi. Everyone looked up and saw a huge projection. In the projection, the arena is moving, and hundreds of arenas are intertwined and stacked together to form a three-dimensional world. This inverted triangular three-dimensional world has three levels. The bottom level is composed of 10 arenas. The second level is composed of 30 arenas, which is much larger than the bottom level. The third floor located on the top is composed of 60 arenas, and there are many arenas. How is this going? Is this a new stadium? Is today's final going to be held in such a stadium? This has never been like this before. Is this a new control rule? Countless people are talking about it. Not only has the stadium changed, but the audience seats have also changed. The auditoriums are also composed of each other, forming a large circle around the field. Several gods looked at the three-dimensional world in front of them, how do you plan to compare? It should be a new rule. No one knows how it compares. The four domain lords should know, but they haven't had any fun yet. Don't worry. As usual, they will definitely be there, before the finals. You see, there are changes in the arena. There are indeed new changes in the three-dimensional arena. There was a golden light flashing among them, and golden eagles appeared one after another. The bear burned, and a large number of demons came out of it. The silver light jumped, and the three silver tribes also appeared in droves. With the god's eyesight, he couldn't tell whether these aliens were real or fake for a moment. Is it real, or is it made up by laws? Not only others were watching, but as the protagonists of this event, the top 16 players also watched this scene happen. Immediately afterwards, invisible power fell on the 16 of them, and the scene in front of them rippled like water ripples. The picture turned from blurry to clear, and 16 people had been teleported to the arena. They stood in a huge white square. In front of them were five high platforms. Four of the high platforms are engraved with different images, namely Qinglong, White Tiger, Suzaku, and Xuanwu, which represent the four star regions of the human race. The high platform in the middle is the most majestic. It is much higher than the four high platforms. On it is a huge city, the Divine City. On the high platforms of the four star regions, there is one person standing respectively, who is the domain master of the four star regions. On the high platform of the sacred city in the center, there was also a person standing, but this person's appearance was blurry and could not be seen clearly. The other side. Lin Moyu thought in his heart. In the finals of the four star region competition, not only the domain masters of the four major star regions will appear, but also a strong man from the other side realm will appear. Elder Lin glanced at everyone. Except for Lin Moyu, everyone felt as if their bodies had been cut by countless swords, and their whole bodies ached. Everyone was awestruck, this strong man was extremely terrifying. If he wants to kill himself, he doesn't even need to take action, just a look is enough. A rich voice slowly sounded, I will announce the rules for the first stage of the finals. In this triangular world, there are three levels, and you are on the third level. Each floor has 16 stone tablets and 16 tokens. You need to find the token, then find the stone tablet corresponding to the token, use the token to open the stone tablet, and then you can go to the next level. It's the same on the second floor and the first floor. Only those who pass the first level are eligible to participate in the second stage of the competition. One more thing, all the previous restrictions in the competition will be lifted from now on. You can use magic weapons and spells at will. 
you can find the token by yourself, or you can snatch the token from the other party. The first stage, limited time. This world is very dangerous, please take care of yourself. After the words fell, the strong man from the other side realm waved his hand. The formation was roaring, and everyone felt dazzled. They had left the square and were in the wilderness. Lin Moyu did not act immediately. He looked up at the formation in the air and felt the tiny movements coming from the formation and space. This world seems to be composed of 70 arenas, each arena is only 100,000 kilometers in diameter. When combined together, it is not much larger. To the little god, millions of kilometers are nothing. But this is not the case at all. Under the influence of the formation, the space has changed. The arena is only external, and the real size can no longer be measured by the size of the arena. In Lin Moyu's opinion, this world is very, very big, far larger than a living galaxy. It is not easy to find the stone tablet and the corresponding token in such a large range. Without restrictions, the excitement of the game will skyrocket. Among the top 16, except for Lin Moyu, they are all minor gods. The little god's methods are not comparable to those before. Skeleton god warriors appeared from Lin Moyu's side one after another, turning into streams of light and running in all directions. A light speed lich appears on Lin Moyu's shoulder, bringing light effect to the skeletons. The first step is to let the skeletons explore the path. At the same time, he can also use the undead vision to check the specific situation of this world. Lin Moyu himself did not move, but was thinking about the rules he had just learned. There are not many pitfalls in the rules this time, but there are also some hidden messages. There is no stipulation in the rules about how many tokens each person can get. If someone gets two tokens on the third level and goes to the second level, then one person in the third level will definitely be eliminated. In addition, there are only ten days, and someone may not find the token and the corresponding stone tablet 690 within ten days. Based on this calculation, someone will definitely be eliminated at this stage. Luck and strength are both indispensable. Lin Moyu has realized the nature of the first stage of the game. It not only tests strength, but also tests luck. Lin Moyu even thought about something deeper. He felt that the higher-ups of the human race were doing something. This could only be accomplished by someone with great luck. Lin Moyu released tens of thousands of skeleton god warriors, just for exploration. 10,000 skeleton god warriors are enough. In Lin Moyu's opinion, 10,000 skeleton warriors are nothing, just one. But in the eyes of others, tens of thousands of skeleton god warriors are already astonishing. My dear, the number of Lin Moyu summons is staggering. Tens of thousands of them, they form an army. I don't know what his combat power is. Now that his strength has recovered, his summons should be stronger than before. He is only the fourth level of God King. No matter how strong the summoned object is, it can't be any stronger. Lin Moyu is in trouble now. His opponents are all minor gods, and he is the only fourth level God King. Yeah, when everyone's strength is suppressed, Lin Moyu doesn't need to be afraid of him. Now I think he is going to be in big trouble. Everyone has their own opinion, but the general opinion is that Lin Moyu is going to be in trouble. After all, now that realm restrictions have been relaxed, how can he, a fourth-level god king, deal with a lesser god? Ching Xiaoxiao was also watching the finals. She waved her fist and shouted, Come on, sister. Kill Lin Moyu, kill Dong Fang Zhe, and win the championship. In the arena, the four territory lords stood on the high platform, looking at each other and smiling. The domain lord of the Qinglong Star Territory is named Yi Qingxian, who is the same as Zhu Tian at the pinnacle of divine status. He looked at Zhu Tian with a smile in his eyes, Zhu Laosan, can Lin Moyu from your star territory win the crown this time? Zhu Tian was full of confidence and said resolutely, it has to be him. The domain lord of the Xuanwu Star Territory is named Wu Da, and he is the bulliest among the four. He said in a low voice, that's not necessarily true. The Xuezhilan of my Xuanwu Star territory is not easy to deal with either. 
The Domain Lord of the White Tiger Star Territory is the only girl among the four. She is a bit gorgeous. She is from the Bai family in the Divine City, and her name is Bai Bingwu. Bai Binger smiled sweetly and said, If Lin Mohun hadn't happened to break through to the gods, how would you have gotten the first place? Wu Da said in a deep voice, before suppressed by the realm, Jilan was not able to exert even one-tenth of her strength. This time there is no restriction, haha. Zhu Tian hummed, it was indeed not the case. Yi Qing Xian snorted coldly, not convinced by what the two said. The four people looked at each other with big eyes and small eyes, no one was convinced by the other. Bai Binger chuckled twice, and suddenly looked at the strong man on the other side of the tower on the central tower, Master Su, what do you think? Lord Su's voice was low, Lord Xingzuan and Lin Moyu are equals. The expressions of the four people all changed. Zhu Tian instinctively felt that it was impossible. What kind of identity was the Holy Lord? How could he be the same person as Lin Moyu? Is there something hidden in it that he doesn't know about? Bai Binger's gorgeous face looked a little stiff, Mr. Su, are you kidding? Mr. Su glanced at her and said, I never talk about medicine. How could he be joking when he was in the other side of the world? Even if he wanted to joke, he would not joke with the deity. Bai Binger felt unhappy, but she didn't dare to get angry. He began to evaluate Lin Moyu's true identity in his mind. How could a little god king be on equal terms with the Holy Lord? There must be something hidden in it. Wuhan University is trying to smooth things over, you will know it after reading it, but now it seems that Lin Moyu is indeed very good. Yi Qing Xian hummed, he is indeed a talent. The cultivators in the Xuanwu Star Territory have three major characteristics. The first is strong defense, the second is magic weapons, puppets are also one of the magic weapons, and the third is having some special summoners. Xue Jilan possesses all three. Not only is she powerful in defense, she is also good at refining weapons. She has refined a large number of puppets for herself. At the same time, she is also a summoner. When she was in Huanshan Continent, she was restricted and could only use the puppets of the true god realm. Although she took advantage of the puppet at first, she gained a lot of points and once ranked third. But later, due to the serious losses of puppets, her ranking gradually dropped. Now, without restrictions, she can use more powerful puppets. She released thousands of puppets of the sixth level of the God King to explore like Lin Moyu. This kind of competition is extremely beneficial to her. Among the top sixteen, there is also a cultivator from the Xuanwu Star region, but he is not a summoner and is not good at puppets. The situation of other people is almost the same. They can only rely on their own strength and luck to find. At present, this final is most beneficial to Lin Moyu and Shui Jilan. The skeleton god warriors sent by Lin Moyu quickly obtained a large amount of information. In this world, there are all kinds of terrains. This is an extremely simulated world. From what I just saw, there are not many aliens in the third floor. The aliens are mainly concentrated on the second and first floors. We are on the third floor. Our main purpose is to find tokens and stone tablets. Tokens and stone tablets must be traceable and will not be thrown into random places. Lin Moyu was conducting analysis, and the skeletons sent back new information. The skeletons found a tribe with ten tribes, belonging to the main silver tribe. This tribe is quite large, with at least tens of thousands of Sanin people living in it. The tribe is divided into three parts. Silver Snake, Silver Dog, and Silver Heron live in their own parts. Their souls are not seen in the undead vision. These aliens are virtual creations, created by laws, and do not exist in real terms. In this way, the role of the undead vision in checking the soul will be greatly weakened. But it won't have much impact. The tribe is shrouded in a formation, and the formation is shining with silver light. It is a formation belonging to the Three Silver Clan, which is very different from the formation of the human race. In the tribe, there are soldiers of the Three Silver Tribe standing one after another, and the entire tribe is under strict protection. 
several skeleton gods flew up thousands of kilometers away from the tribe to check. Lin Moyu connects the vision of the skeletons. Although the undead vision cannot view the soul, it still has incomparable advantages. The formation basically has no effect on the vision of the undead. Lin Moyu saw the situation in the tribe through the formation. In a world composed of gray and white, there is a large gray stone monument that is particularly conspicuous. Found it. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the skeleton god warrior quickly crushed him. You can't see the soul, and there is a formation that separates you, so you can't judge the opponent's strength. But it's not important, you'll know after playing it. After his realm was no longer suppressed, Lin Moyu's realm returned to the fourth level of God King. The combat power of the skeleton god warrior also soared significantly, reaching the seventh level of Kanda. As a vanguard, it is completely sufficient. The friction between bones makes a crackling sound, wandering in this quiet world. Thousands of skeleton god warriors rushed towards the formation like streams of light, swinging their axes to chop. The formation was distorted under the axe, but it was unexpectedly strong and was not broken at once. The three silvers in the formation were suddenly attacked and responded quickly. The formation sparkled, and attacks came out from the formation and fell on the divine warrior. The formation is open to the outside but not to the inside. Attacks from inside can be penetrated, but those from outside cannot penetrate. Lin Moyu has rich experience in group operations, so this is no surprise. The attack of the Sanin tribe is not strong, only at the level of the seventh level of the god king. Hitting the skeleton god warriors would only cause them some damage at most. With a thought in his heart, more than a hundred skeleton god generals flew out, turned into streams of light and rushed to the battlefield. There are still thousands of kilometers, twenty-four apart, and the powerful sword energy has already swept over. The sword energy hit the formation, and the distorted formation exploded on the spot. The sword energy shattered the formation and killed a large number of Sanin people. The skeleton god warriors charged in, killing everyone they saw. The Sanin tribe rebelled wildly, their silver barks sending out bursts of sound waves, and streaks of silver light falling from the sky, bright and beautiful. The silver snake rolled up and whipped its long tail like a whip, and many skeleton god warriors were whipped away. Ilu's attacks mainly focus on their mouths. Their mouths are sharper than the magic weapons of the god king realm and can directly break the bones of the skeleton god warriors. The human race formation not only simulated the three silver tribes, but also simulated their attack methods. The Sanin tribe had a large number of people, but they surrounded the skeleton god warrior. The skeleton god general then rushed to the ground, swung the sharp sword in his hand with a dazzling sword light, and killed the big three-eyed clan with three strikes and five strikes. The Sanin people do not leave corpses behind after they die. They are virtual objects simulated by the formation. After death, the corpses disappear directly through photonization. With the addition of the skeleton god general, the battle became one-sided. One hundred skeleton god generals, who were as tall as a minor god, wiped out the entire tribe with overwhelming force. When Lin Moyu arrived in a hurry, the entire tribe had been completely cleared and empty, except for a ten-meter-high stone tablet erected in the center of the tribe. The stone tablet looks like there is nothing strange about it. There is a huge word engraved on it, tongue licking. Lin Moyu recognizes the word, five. It means number five. To activate this monument, you need the same token numbered five. Ten skeleton god generals were left to guard here, and then more skeletons were released to continue exploring the world. I saw a large number of alien races appearing before. It seems that they have formed tribes. If the stone tablet appears in the tribe, where will the token appear? Besides the alien race, there seem to be some giant beasts. Is the giant beast related to the token? Lin Moyu thinks it is not impossible, but it is a pity that it has not been found yet. On the other side, Xue Jilan also just wiped out a tribe of the Golden Eagle tribe. The Golden Eagle tribe is relatively small in number, with only about a thousand members. Each member's combat power is around the sixth level of the God King, 
which is comparable to her puppets. But with her as a little god here and the puppets working together, it didn't take much effort to clean up. Shui Jilan also found a stone tablet numbered 10. Shui Jilan didn't recognize the word, but it didn't matter. She kept the word in her heart and knew she had to look for the corresponding symbol. Dongfangs had just finished a battle, and he was standing in the ruins. This small fortress belonging to the demon clan had just been destroyed by him. All the demons inside were killed. In the fortress, a stone tablet numbered six was erected. Among the top sixteen, almost everyone found the corresponding tribal fortress and discovered the stone tablet. Except for Lin Moyu and Shui Jilan, everyone else's battles are a bit more difficult. After all, they are all working alone and are not as relaxed as they are. Even Lin Moyu himself didn't take action. Everyone outside the court seemed to have a new understanding of Lin Moyu's skeleton. The skeleton god general is more powerful than everyone imagined. Through the battles of other minor gods, it can be inferred that the enemy strength simulated by the formation is basically between the sixth and seventh levels of the god king. From this, extrapolating the strength of Lin Moyu's skeleton, people were surprised to find that the skeleton god general also has the combat power of a minor god. 100 minor god level summons, and I don't know if this is Lin Moyu's limit, and I don't know if he can summon more and stronger ones. This discovery made everyone uproar. How can we fight like this? Everyone is a little god. One hundred little gods are not crushing others to death. How do I feel that Lin Moyu alone is enough to challenge fifteen other people? That can't be said. There is still a big gap between the little god lord and the little god lord, especially Qing Fei and Dong Fang Zhe. Their strength is almost as strong as the god lord. The four domain masters also saw this scene and were extremely curious about Lin Moyu's combat power. They all looked at Zhu Tian, who shook his head and said, Don't look at me. In recent years, Lin Moyu has been at the Suzaku battlefield, and I don't know. If you want to know, ask Boss Zhu, he knows. Zhu Tian immediately put all the blame on Zhu Qiwu, it was none of his business anyway. By Binger snorted, Ask Zhu Qiwu? Forget it, I don't want to make myself uncomfortable. Wu De and Yu Qingxian also had similar expressions. They both seemed a little afraid of Zhu Qiwu. Zhu Tian chuckled and said, Keep reading, you will know if you keep reading. In fact, he is also very curious about Lin Moyu's strength. Moreover, he asked Zhu Qiwu, but Yi Jiwu didn't tell him clearly. Lin Moyu took the initiative to mention it, but he didn't make it too clear. Anyway, Lin Moyu said there was no pressure against him. As the area explored by the skeleton god warrior became larger and larger, new discoveries were finally made. On the top of a high mountain, there is a golden giant beast. He has the body of a snake and the head of a lion, with golden scales that reflect the dazzling golden light. Its huge blood-red tongue can be seen from a distance, with barbs on its tongue. Teeth that are sharper than magic weapons are extremely ferocious. He was 10,000 meters long, and the gas he sprayed turned into black clouds and scattered on the earth, corroding the earth into huge holes. The alien race simulated by the formation has no breath of life and no soul, but it will have coercion. Lin Moyu felt its pressure, which was unique to the little god. A giant beast at the level of a minor god. Lin Moyu didn't care. With a thought in his heart, he turned into a stream of light and flew towards it. Counting the ten skeleton generals guarding the stone tablet, Lin Moyu has summoned 110 skeleton generals. Although this is just a drop in the bucket, Lin Moyu feels that it is enough and there is no need to expose too much information to the public. The giant beast discovered the skeleton god general from a distance and roared ten times. Dark clouds suddenly flew over bringing corrosive raindrops to the skeleton god general. The raindrops fell on the skeleton god general, making a tingling sound and rising yellow gas. The skeleton god general ignored these raindrops, and the slight damage was shared by the undead army. There was not much that could really hurt them. The sword energy is white and majestic, spanning thousands of miles and engulfing the earth.
The sword energy was extremely bright, lighting up the earth. The white light seemed to be full of vitality, but that was just an appearance, inside was the boundless power of destruction. Each of the skeleton god generals is like a small god. Maybe he doesn't have as many tricks as the little god lord, and he doesn't have earth-shattering spells, but his attack power is not weak at all. Hundreds of skeleton god generals wielded their sword energy at the same time, and the powerful destructive power created by them was difficult for even small gods of the same level to withstand. In the majestic sword energy, the mountains collapsed and the giant beasts howled. The giant beast was torn apart in the sword energy, its golden scales were torn apart and dripping with blood. The formation simulation is very realistic. The various manifestations of giant beasts are no different from the real world. A giant beast in the realm of the little god, with extremely strong vitality. It flew out with sword energy and flew toward the skeleton god general. The giant beast was very fast and appeared in front of the skeleton god general across thousands of miles in an instant. It was in tatters, with bloodstains and holes everywhere, and most of its golden scales had collapsed. The huge body became the most powerful weapon, colliding with the skeleton god general. There was a loud bang, the earth shook, and the whole world was shaking. More than a dozen skeleton gods will be knocked away. It opened its huge mouth and sprayed out a thick, corrosive mist, covering a group of skeleton generals. At the same time, it flicked its head and bit several other skeleton generals. The teeth are so strong that they will bite the skeleton god general into pieces. The skeleton god general's body is extremely strong, and it is not something he can do easily. The skeleton god who was knocked away flew back again, swung his sharp bone sword, and slashed at the giant beast densely. Every time the sword strikes, a large piece of flesh and blood will be cut off from the giant beast. The skeleton generals shrouded in the corrosive fog also rushed out, and they seemed intact. They also raised and lowered their swords, cutting off large pieces of flesh and blood from the giant beast. In the blink of an eye, there was no good piece of meat on the giant beast, and the bones were completely exposed. The blood spilled like a waterfall, staining the ground red, and it looked extremely bloody. The formation seemed to even simulate the smell of blood, and Lin Moyu could smell it from a long distance away. Lin Moyu couldn't help but frowned, this bloody smell seems too normal. The smell of blood is not a real taste, but a feeling from the soul level. The blood of a giant beast at the level of a minor god contains huge laws, and the smell of blood will spread to all directions in the big world along the lines of ubiquitous laws. The giant beast kept wailing, and the smell of blood became stronger and stronger. Lin Moyu felt something was wrong, it was too real. Even if the formation simulation is very realistic, you can still see the difference between it and the reality. Except that there is no soul, as long as you look carefully, there will be differences in other places. But the little god realm giant beast in front of me seems to be no different from the real giant beast. Lin Moyu's heart moved and he switched to the undead vision. A hot and huge soul fire is burning there. No wonder it's so true. Lin Moyu finally understood that the giant beast in front of him was not a simulation of the formation, but a real giant beast. The four-star domain competition adopts a method of combining virtuality and reality. There are fake ones simulated by formations, and there are also real behemoths. Seeing this, Lin Moyu realized that the undead vision was useful again. You can use undead vision to find those giant beasts and then kill them. If it's as I thought, and the tokens are obtained by defeating the giant beast, then I might be able to obtain multiple tokens. It doesn't seem to be difficult to eliminate a few people. If he could get multiple tokens, Lin Moyu felt that he would have the initiative in this competition. Thinking of this, Lin Moyu no longer wanted to be entangled with this giant beast. With a thought in his heart, another hundred skeleton god generals appeared and joined the battle group. The sword energy spread across the ground, and the giant beast screamed in agony. It was already at a complete disadvantage, and now it has hit rock bottom. Just a minute later, the beast was killed. When it died, its body was in pieces, its flesh and blood spread all over the earth, and it was extremely miserable. 
After it died, a ray of light fell from the sky and enveloped the earth. The corpse of the giant beast turned into a point of light and disappeared, and the earth returned to its original state in the blink of an eye. At the same time, a golden token appeared. Sure enough, the trap can be obtained by killing the giant beast. Lin Moyu picked up the token, which had the word engraved on it. This is the token corresponding to stone tablet number three. Before he could put the token away, suddenly a bright light shot straight into the sky, illuminating the whole sky. Invisible fluctuations were transmitted, and a large area of light appeared in the sky. Lin Moyu looked at the sky and found that there was a pillar of light above his head, reaching straight to the sky and connected to the formation. This is a guidepost. Lin Moyu immediately knew what was going on. This was the same situation as in the small world eternal battlefield. A similar situation happened when he obtained the origin rune. It is conceivable that everyone on the field now knows that he has obtained the token and can find his exact location through the guiding signs. Lin Moyu didn't feel anything about this. He wished that someone would come to him and then eliminate the opponent manually. He once again released a thousand skeleton god warriors and began to search for traces of the giant beasts on the field. At the same time that he obtained the token, the other five people also received reminders from the Renlai network. Contestant number one has obtained the token, and the formation has begun to guide the way. You can follow the guide signs to find player number one. Everyone sees the beacons on the formation, and you can find Lin Moyu along the beacons. Dong Fang Zhe looked at the sky, Lin Moyu, you move really fast. Let you be proud for a while. Now is not the time for us to fight. Sooner or later, I will have a good fight with you to let you know who is number one. Dong Fang Zhe had anger in his eyes and was not convinced at all. Qing Fei received the news, glanced at the sky, and stopped paying attention. Her attention fell on a giant beast 10,000 meters away, and she waved a blue sword. Xuei Jilan came to the edge of a lake and looked at the calm lake, Xiao Hong, you said there is a big guy here, right? Sitting on her shoulder was a fiery red elf the size of a fist. The elf said in words that only Xiao Jilan could understand, yes, he is a very, very big guy. Xiao Jilan showed a cute smile, how big? The little red elf stretched out his hands and gestured. They were as big as his master. Xiao Jilan understood that there was a giant beast in the lake. She whispered to herself, the stone tablet is in the tribe, and the token should be on the giant beast. Lin Moyu has obtained a token. Xiao Hong felt the breath of battle just now. It should have happened between Lin Moyu and Mu Lu. Lin Moyu's combat power is indeed very strong, and the behemoth of the little god lord was easily killed. But I'm not bad either. Her eyes were shining, and her hands were knotted in knots. A three-headed puppet appeared next to him. The puppet looked like a swordsman with a long sword on his back. He was about five meters tall and looked very powerful. Shui Jilan activated the three-headed puppet, and the puppet's eyes flashed red. Shui Jilan frowned slightly, as if she was under some pressure. There are also corresponding requirements for controlling puppets. With her strength, it is already the limit to control three puppets in the minor god realm at the same time. Here we go. With a slight drink, Xue Jilan pointed her finger, and the law exploded. The surface of the lake exploded, and a huge creature rushed out of the lake. The skeleton god warriors are running fast on the field, and with the presence of the light speed lich, they are very fast. Soon they found the second beast. Even though they are thousands of miles apart, the soul flame of the little god realm still attracts people's attention. After finding the giant beast, the skeleton god general quickly rushed over and besieged the giant beast. Two hundred skeleton generals have the combat power to crush giant beasts. By the time Lin Moyu arrived, the giant beast of the little god realm had been torn into pieces. The light of the formation was covering the earth, and the corpse had become actinic. Lin Moyu didn't even see the true appearance of the giant beast. The earth recovered under the power of the formation, erasing the traces of the battle, leaving only a token. Lin Moyu picked up the token, and there happened to be the word on the token, which corresponded to the number five stone tablet. 
Good luck. Stone tablet number 5 and the token have been found, and he can go to the second floor at any time. But he has no plans to leave just yet. Now that the second token has been found, it means that at least one person is about to be eliminated. If he can get more tokens, more people will be eliminated, and he can even control who is eliminated. Taking control of the initiative, why not do this kind of thing? Just when Lin Moyu obtained the second token, everyone received another prompt from Renhuang Network. Contestant number one has obtained the second token, and the formation has begun to guide the way. Player number one can be found along the guide signs. Everyone was stunned for a moment. Dong Fang Zhe paused in his steps and couldn't believe it. How is it possible? How could he be so fast? If not, I have to find the token as soon as possible, and I can't be outmatched by him. Qing Fei, who was fighting against the giant monster of the little god, felt a little in her heart, the second token, so someone is about to be eliminated. The sword power became more fierce, unleashing earth shattering attacks. Xue Jilan looked at the dying beast not far away, Lin Moyu is really fast. Am I really going to lose? Each of the little gods realized that Lin Moyu was really powerful. At the same time, they also know that someone on this level will definitely be eliminated. It is almost impossible to snatch the token from Lin Moyu. There are now 2,000 skeleton god warriors looking for tribes and tokens and 200 skeleton gods will add up to wherever they are needed. Soon, the third token was also obtained by Lin Moyu, which was the token numbered one. Then even the tribal fortress was discovered, and Lin Moyu found more stone tablets. The aliens in the tribe have been cleared away. Unlike Lin Moyu, others can lead their hands to look at the stone monument. Outside the stadium, countless pairs of eyes watched the game. Lin Moyu's performance fell in their eyes and many people showed excitement. Lin Moyu has won three tokens. He is too strong. He will definitely be the champion in this game. He is still looking for new tokens. Each additional token means that a person will be eliminated. Lin Moyu completely dominated this game. Lin Moyu seems to have gone too far. Will those who have not found the token unite to deal with Lin Moyu? It's very possible. I think Lin Moyu should just give up when things get better. Stop it, that's how it should be, it's best to get all the tokens and solve the problem at once. What can those people do if they join forces? Lin Moyu has 200 summons of the little god realm. They may not be able to defeat him if they join forces. Everyone has different opinions and everyone has their own ideas. The four domain masters also watched the game. Although Zhu Tian didn't say anything, the expression on his face betrayed his mood. He was in a very good mood. Lin Moyu's performance was outstanding, far superior to others. Bai Binger saw that the players in her own star field had not found a single token so far, and she felt a little anxious, why are these guys so stupid? Wuhan University was in a much better mood. Xue Jilan was about to get a token. As long as he could get a token, there would be no problem in entering the second level. Wu Di chuckled and said, Don't worry, what is coming will come as it should. Bai Binger glared at him, Son, you are itchy, aren't you? Wu Di smiled at Bai Binger, A good man won't get along with the queen. Yi Qingxian, the domain master of the Azure Dragon Star territory, didn't look very good at this time. Although Qing Fei was about to get a token, the other people didn't even see the token. If this continues, maybe only one person from the Qinglong Starfield will be able to enter the second level. You must know that among the top 16, players from the Azure Dragon Star region can occupy four seats. It would be a bit embarrassing if three people were eliminated on the third level. But he didn't say anything, just watched quietly, at least there was a guarantee which was better than Bai Binger in the White Tiger Star territory. Unconsciously, he glanced at Bai Binger, and that look made Bai Binger feel extremely unhappy. What is the most important thing for a god, face? Bai Binger gritted her silver teeth and said, It's all Lin Mohan's fault. Now that she has been promoted to a god, we can't delay it. When the competition is over, I want to have a good talk with her. 
The ancestor of the Sioux family, who had been silent for a long time, suddenly spoke, I suggest you not to cause trouble for her. Her promotion to the deity was promoted by Saint Howe, Elder Lin, and Madame Yu. Bai Binger was stunned on the spot with her eyes widened. Not only her, the other three were also stunned. What does this mean? When will the existence of the other side care about a little god? Moreover, it was three other people from the other side who worked together to help Lin Mohun become a god. What kind of identity was this Lin Mohun? The ancestor of the Sioux family continued, God Lord Gladiolus is about to enter the other side. These words were another heavy blow. Lin Mohun not only had three other people standing behind him, but his master would also become another person. This status seems to be more noble than by Binger. By Binger tried her best to squeeze out a smile, what I said about talking is really just talking, I invited her to drink. The ancestor of the Sioux family hummed, this is the best. Among the four territory lords, Zhu Tian knows the most inside information. He knew that Lin Moyu and Lin Mohun were siblings. The ancestor of the Sioux family also said just now that Xingzuan and Lin Moyu were equal to each other. Now that he heard about Lin Mohun again, Zhu Tian couldn't help but have some guesses. It's not that Lin Mohan's face is big, nor is it that Lord Gladiolus is about to be promoted to the other side, it's more likely that Lin's face is big. It's because of Lin Xiaozi's relationship that Saint Hao and the others helped Lin Mohan advance to the rank of God. What's so special about Mr. Lin and why is he like this? He once asked Zhu Qiwu related questions but Zhu Qiwu didn't reveal even a single sentence, so Zhu Tian had no choice but to give up. In the arena, two more road signs appeared. The two landmarks appeared almost at the same time, and there was no distinction between them. One sign points to Qing Fei, and the other sign points to Xue Ji Lan. The two men also received tokens. This makes others more anxious, and their sense of urgency further increases. Five of the sixteen tokens have already been released. Lin Moyu got three pieces, Qing Fei and Xue Jilan each got one piece, and there were eleven tokens left, but there were still thirteen players. The competition becomes more intense, Dongfangs traveled tens of millions of kilometers and finally saw a giant beast. The moment he saw the giant beast, Dongfangs already understood how to obtain the token. Wei Boan finally found a giant beast. Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong came together, they locked a target and were moving forward quickly. The prompts from Renhuang Network appear again and again, and each time they will be accompanied by guiding signs, telling you who has obtained the token and where it is. In just one day, 15 tokens appeared out of 16 tokens. The last piece is about to appear. Lin Moyu has found the last token, and the skeleton god is rushing over. Among the sixteen tokens, six tokens are in his hand, and soon the seventh-day token will also fall into his hand. When the seven tokens are obtained, Lin Moyu only needs to find the corresponding stone tablet and teleport to the second-level area. At that time, six players will be unable to enter the second level and will be eliminated directly. However, Lin Moyu was a little surprised that Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong didn't get the token. With the strength of the two of them, it would not be a problem to deal with the giant beasts in the minor god realm. And with Zhuang Bai's intelligence, it's impossible not to find the correct way to obtain the token. Suddenly, a guiding sign disappeared. At the same time, the prompt from Renhuang Network rang in everyone's ears. Contestant number two has entered the second level. Qing Fei entered the second floor. Lin Moyu is not surprised. Entering the second level first can take advantage of it. He could have left long ago, but now, he still has something to deal with. Only ten minutes after Qing Fei entered the second floor, another guidepost disappeared. Contestant number 11 has entered the second level. Xue Jilan also entered the second floor. Xue Jilan is numbered 11, ranking low among the top 16, and her soul is not very powerful but her special ability makes her a duck in water in this game. Dongfang Zhe looked at this scene like a meteor streaking across the sky. 
He quickly found the corresponding stone tablet and said, Lin Moyu, it's not time for us to fight yet. Leaving behind a sentence that only he could hear, Dong Fangs activated the stone tablet and entered the second floor. Contestant number three has entered the second level. Contestant number eight has entered the second level. People continue to find the stone tablet and enter the second floor, while fewer and fewer people stay on the third floor. But Lin Moyu never moved. The four domain masters felt strange, and Wu De murmured, whatever he wants to do, he should enter the second level as soon as possible to seize the opportunity. While she was speaking, she looked towards Zhu Tian. At this moment, his mood has improved. A player from White Tiger Star has obtained the token and has entered the second level. Among the top 16, there are only two people in the White Tiger Star region. If one person can enter the second level, it is considered to meet the basic requirements. On the other hand, Qinglong Star Territory occupies four seats among the top 16, but at this moment, only Qing Fei has entered the second level. Proportionally speaking, it is not as good as my own White Star Territory. Zhu Tian said, he is looking for someone. Find someone? Indeed, the ancient people released by Lin Moyu at this time did look like they were looking for someone. More than 2,000 skeletons fly in and out of the arena. Yi Qingxian whispered, he is looking for Zhuang Bai, number 4, and Chu Xiong, number 5. Zhu Tian said, he and Zhuang Chu Xiong are good friends. Wu De chuckled and said, someone is going to be in trouble. Wuhan University is in a particularly good mood and both players from the Xuanwu Star Territory have entered the second level. While speaking, his eyes fell on Yi Qingxian. Not only him, but also Yi Tian and Bai Bing looked at Yi Qingxian heartily. Among the seven people left on the third floor, there are three from the Azure Dragon Star region, three from the Vermilion Bird Star region, and one from the White Tiger Star region. However, all seven tokens are in the hands of Lin Moyu. If they want to enter the second level, they can only get the tokens from Lin Moyu. Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong followed the guidepost and flew towards Lin Moyu's location. Behind them, three players from the Azure Dragon Star region were chasing them. Lin Moyu finally discovered Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong, learned about their situation, and turned into a stream of light and rushed towards them. Soon the two sides met, and Chu Xiong said loudly, Junior brother Lin, I finally found you. Lin Moyu glanced at the two of them, Why are you so seriously injured? Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong were not in good condition at the moment and were seriously injured. Especially Chu Xiong, there are four fist sized holes in his abdomen, front and back. The blood was still flowing, and the internal organs had long been shattered. There are fierce laws on the wound that prevent the physical body from healing. Although to the God King, the body is not important. But if his body is severely injured, most of his combat power will be lost. Zhuang Bai was also injured, but he looked better than Chu Xiong. Two laws popped up as Lin Moyu spoke. The law of immortality carried the majestic power of life and fell on the two of them. The power of life quickly drove away the foreign laws on Chu Xiong and began to treat the injury. Zhuang Bai said, We were attacked by someone. Chu Xiong looked at the three people coming from behind, three bastards, they suddenly attacked me while I was dealing with the giant beast. But they didn't take advantage, and in the end, they didn't get the token either. Zhuang Bai quickly explained the matter. The two of them found a giant beast. After a fierce battle, they were about to kill the giant beast, but they were attacked by a person from the Qinglong Star Territory. The Qinglong Star Territory's attack was at the top of the four star territories. Under the sudden attack, Chu Xiong was immediately hit hard, and Zhuang Bai was not spared either. However, the two did not sit back and fight back. They fought back with injuries to prevent those from the Azure Dragon Star region from taking advantage. Unexpectedly, a player from the Divine City appeared at this time, quickly killed the giant beast and took away the token. The man was very fast and the people from Qinglong Star Territory could not catch up, so they turned their anger towards Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong. Zhuang Bi Chu Xiong was injured first, and his number was one less, so he lost to the enemy and began to retreat. 
As each player entered the second level, only Lin Moyu remained. Zhuang Bai also knew that Lin Moyu was looking for him, so he came with Chu Xiong to find Lin Moyu. They believe in Lin Moyu's ability. Needless to say, the three people in the Qinglong Star Territory must also want to ask Lin Moyu for the token. Now Lin Moyu has seven tokens in his hand. As long as he can distribute them to them, they can also enter the second level. Three players from the Azure Dragon Star Territory shot towards them. Before they could stop, they shouted loudly, Lin Moyu, hand over your token. You can't leave today without handing over the token. Before they finished speaking, their expressions suddenly changed. Not good. Defense. A large number of skeletons appeared around Lin Moyu, surrounding them almost instantly. Then the dazzling white sword energy swallowed them up, and the attack was extremely violent. Hundreds of skeleton god generals who were comparable to small gods attacked at the same time, and the sword energy swallowed them up. Lin Moyu moved too quickly, without even asking why, and didn't even give them a chance to speak. Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong's words are enough, there is no need to say anything more to them. Amidst the sword energy, screams rang out. Then, three green dragons flew out, broke through the sword energy, and fled quickly. The three of them were seriously injured in an instant and their bodies were covered with wounds. If they stayed here any longer, they would die. Lin Moyu's heart moved, and the skeleton god quickly launched a pursuit. In the third floor, there are still two hundred skeleton gods wandering outside, and they are also joining the pursuit at this moment. Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong stared at this scene blankly. After a few seconds, Chu Xiong extended his thumb and said, Junior Brother Lin, you are awesome. Zhuang Bai said with a smile, Junior Brother Lin can always bring surprises to people. With a little effort, two senior brothers, come with me. Lin Moyu popped up the law of immortality again, treated their injuries, and at the same time led them to fly towards the nearest stone monument. The expressions of the four territory lords at this time were colorful and different. The ugliest one is undoubtedly Yi Qing Xian. The corners of his mouth twitched unconsciously, wanting to get angry, but there was nowhere to do so. Lin Moyu's actions determined the fate of the three players in the Qinglong Starfield. There's no chance they'll get to the second level. By Binger coughed slightly, actually, I think Lin Moyu is a pretty good person. If we discuss it carefully, it's not impossible for him to give away two tokens. Seeing Yi Ching Xuan's ugly face, Bai Binger changed her words again, but it doesn't matter now. At least Qing Fei succeeded. I only have one family in the White Tiger Star territory. Wuhan University echoed by Binger's words, that is, just one Qing Fei is enough, but having more people is of no use. After hearing what he said, Yi Qing Xuan's face looked a little better. At least Qing Fei is still there, Qing Fei is very strong, one person is enough to defeat the three of them. Thinking this way, it seems much better. Zhu Tian was finishing his attack at this moment, it's really useless to have more people. Anyway, if you encounter Lin Moyu, the result will be the same. Yi Qing Xuan's expression turned ugly again, Zhu Laosan, if you don't know how to speak, just shut up. Zhu Tian was in a very good mood at the moment and did not care about Yi Qing Xian. He feels that he is really proud now. With Lin Moyu here, the four-star field competition is stable. Bai Binger suddenly frowned, wondering what this guy was going to do. Wuhan University also discovered something unusual. They saw a practitioner from the White Tiger Star region following Lin Moyu and his party. He used a special magic weapon to hide his figure, and Lin Moyu and others did not discover him. It was only a little over a day after the game started, and Lin Moyu had already figured out most of the third layer. At least four of the seven tokens in his hand, he knew the specific locations of the corresponding stone tablets. He led Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong to the nearest stone monument. At this time, Zhuang Bai's injuries were completely healed, and Chu Xiong's injuries were mostly healed. Lin Moyu handed a corresponding token to Zhuang Bai, Brother Zhuang, we'll see you on the second level. Zhuang Bai hummed, see you on the second floor. 
Zhuang Bai activated the token and teleported into the second set. Lin Moyu immediately took Chu Xiong to another stone monument. Just now on the way, he already knew that there was a divine king level magic weapon between Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong. After they enter the second floor, they can get together quickly. If two people act together, the safety will be much higher. Being attacked once is enough, it won't happen a second time. When he came to the second stone monument, Chu Xiong's injury was completely healed. Watching him teleport into the second floor, Lin Moyu suddenly said to the side, This senior brother has been following me all the way. If you have anything to do, let's talk to him face to face. A few seconds later, something thousands of meters away, the space seemed like a curtain was pulled open, and a person was revealed. Hello, junior brother Lin, my name is Hu Tian, number 18. Lin Moyu knows the resources of each player by heart, so he naturally knows Hu Tian. Hu Tian comes from the White Tiger Star territory. He is also a minor god with extraordinary combat power. In the top 16 competition, he defeated players with lower numbers than himself and entered the top 16. In fact, he was already there, following him all the way, and showed no ill intentions from beginning to end. It's the same now, very polite and polite. Lin Moyu asked, Senior Brother Hu, just tell me if you have something to do. Hu Tian scratched his head and felt a little embarrassed. Junior Brother Lin, I am shameless and want to ask you to buy a token. He is tall and strong, somewhat similar to Chu Xiong, and also somewhat kind-hearted. He used by instead of other words. There is a price to pay for buying it. Lin Moyu said with a smile, what price does senior brother Hu plan to offer? Seeing that Lin Moyu did not refuse, Hu Tian knew something was up, I have a defensive magic weapon of the God King realm here. Although it is only the middle level of the God King, the effect is pretty good. Lin Moyu shook his head, I don't want a magic weapon. Lin Moyu's vision is so high that the magic weapon of the God King realm is not in his eyes at all, at least he must have the magic weapon of the God Sovereign realm. Seeing that Lin Moyu didn't want the magic weapon, God seemed to have some hope for healing. In his opinion, the most valuable thing of his worth is this God King realm magic weapon. If it weren't for the ranking, he would really be reluctant to do so. Just when he was disappointed, Lin Moyu said, Senior brother Tiger should know a lot about the power of faith, right? Hu Tian nodded instinctively, some research. Lin Moyu said, well, I want a piece of information on the power of faith. I want brother who's understanding and experience of the power of faith. The more detailed the better. That's it? Hu Tian couldn't believe it. Lin Moyu smiled and confirmed, that's it. Chi Tian seemed to become even more embarrassed, junior brother Lin will suffer a loss in this way. In fact, the information you want can be easily found when you arrive in the White Tiger Star territory. I know, but I just want it now. Lin Moyu said with a smile. Okay, I got a big advantage. Hu Tian took out a jade tablet, stirred his soul power, and engraved all his understanding of the power of faith into it on the spot. At the same time, he took out two more jade tablets, totaling three, and threw them to Lin Moyu. One of them is my own understanding, and the other two are information about the power of faith in the God King realm. Lin Moyu had no doubts. After receiving the jade token, he put it away without checking it on the spot. Instead, he threw a token to Hu Tian, pointed in a direction, and said, In this direction, there is a stone monument two million kilometers away. Hu Tian took the token and thanked Lin Moyu excitedly, Thank you, junior brother Lin. With the token, he can enter the second level without being eliminated here. Lin Moyu waved his hand, it's just a fair transaction, brother Hu, there's no need to be polite. Hu Tian said, I understand, I owe junior brother Lin a favor. If junior brother Lin comes to the White Tiger Star territory when he has time in the future, remember to come to me. I live in Hu's house in the Peastern Galaxy. Hu Tian left with thanks and Lin Moyu also turned around and flew towards another stone monument. The three Qinglong Starfield players who were being chased by the skeleton god general suddenly received a prompt. 
Contestant number one has entered the second level. Immediately afterwards, the skeleton gods disappeared collectively. I finally left. I thought I was going to die here. How can Lin Moyu be so scary? Is he really only the fourth level of God King? The three of us are all minor gods, yet we are hunted down to this extent. The three of them sighed, but fortunately, Lin Moyu left. Contestant number 19 laughed sadly, are we the only three people eliminated? No, there is another guy from the White Tiger Star region, the one at number 18, he didn't get the token either. At this time, the reminder from Renhuang Network sounded again. Contestant number 18 has entered the second level. The three of them were stunned and looked at each other. Then the scene in front of them changed, and when they came to their senses, they had returned to Dobby City. For them, it's over. Although they entered the top 16, they were the last three in the top 16. The point is not fame, but shame. They knew that the scene of themselves being chased by Lin Moyu had been seen by the entire human race. This is really embarrassing. When I return to the White Tiger Star territory, I will probably be too embarrassed to go out in the past few decades. There is also the territory Lord Yi Qingxuan's hurdle, I don't know how to pass it. It is inevitable that they will be taught a lesson, and I don't know if they will be punished. The three of them were disgraced and huddled in their residence, treating their injuries. As Hu Tian entered the second level, the formation roared, and the third level arena suddenly disintegrated. It turns into layers of high walls, wrapping the last two layers. At the same time, everyone discovered that the game screen had disappeared. No one can see the rest of the game. For a moment everyone asked questions, wondering what happened. For a time, the entire human star field was raising questions and wanting to know what happened. Why did the match projection suddenly disappear? Soon Renhuang Network gave everyone the answer. The following competition will not be made public for the time being because it involves the secrets of the human race. After the next stage of the competition starts, projection will start again. No one expected such a thing to happen. But the human race is very united and tolerant, and no one doubts the explanation given by the Human Emperor Network. Almost everyone is on the side of Renhuang Network and supports what Renhuang Network does. Indeed, there are so many foreign guests coming this time, so of course we cannot let them know the secret. What's more, there are many spies in the human race, and some secrets cannot be revealed. I support Renhuang Network's approach. Anyway, we can see it in the next stage. Don't worry, don't worry. I can only silently wish all players to perform at their best. On the playing field, the four territory lords are still there. They can still see the entire process of the game, which is also their privilege. Except for them, other gods watching the game could not see the specific situation of by kiln at this moment. The majestic and rich voice of the ancestor of the Sioux family sounded, You four, mind your mouths. The four of them were shocked, knowing that the next game might actually involve the secrets of the human race, rather than just talk. Although they are domain masters, the real secret of the human race is not in the four star domains, but in the divine city. There are some things that even they don't know. The four of them opened their eyes and planned to see what the secret was. Yi Qingxuan's depression at this moment was also swept away, and curiosity shone in his eyes. After Hu Tian finally entered the second level, the thirteen people in the second level simultaneously received information from the Human Emperor Network. Attention all players! The game has been suspended, and whatever you do next will not be known to anyone. You can use all your strengths without worrying about your information being leaked. Instructions on the second layer will be added below, please listen carefully. A powerful enemy leader will appear in the center of the second floor. Those who kill the enemy leader can directly enter the first level and obtain a very powerful magic weapon. This powerful magic weapon can play a huge role in the next stage of Beidou. There is only one enemy leader and he is very powerful. Please be careful with the players. At the second level, anyone who dies for any reason or loses the ability to continue fighting will be eliminated directly. Everyone was shocked when they heard the newly added rules. 
there is one more way to get to the next level. Not only can you get to the next level, but you can also get a powerful magic weapon. Powerful magic weapons will play a huge role in the next stage of the competition. This rule has become very attractive, and defeating the alien leader in the central area has become the first choice for many people. The rules say that the alien leader will appear in the center of the second floor, but where is the center of the second floor? They were on the second floor and couldn't determine the specific direction at all. Almost everyone doesn't know whether they are near the edge or the center. Obviously, the first person to reach the center point will definitely have an advantage. Dongfengs looked around and couldn't tell the direction, so he couldn't help but cursed, why break the rules? Such rules are beneficial to Lin Moyo. Wei Boan was also thinking to himself at this moment, how do I feel that Renhuang Network is favoring Lin Moyo? But in this case, he can only think about it but dare not say it out loud. Ching Fei took out a bird-shaped jade magic weapon at this time. Her soul moved, go. The jade magic weapon exploded into pieces and exploded into thousands of flying birds, flying in all directions. Shui Jilan touched the red elf on her shoulder and said, Xiao Hong, can you help me find the center point? Xiao Hong barked twice, then flew into the air and disappeared in a whoosh. The speed is as fast as a god. Zhuang Bai and Chu Xiong were lucky this time. They were very close to each other and quickly came together. Zhuang Bai once again took out the jade eyeball magic weapon and placed it on his forehead. After searching around, he determined the direction. Chu Xiong asked, Lao Zhuang, are we going to kill the foreign leader? Zhuang Bai shook his head, if you don't want to go, we will look for the stone tablet and token. He knew very well that his strength was not bad, but compared to people like Dong Feng Zhe and Qing Fei, there was still a gap. It is not their place to fight to kill the alien leaders. On the contrary, while others are looking for the alien leaders, they can find tokens and stone tablets and enter the first level as soon as possible. Lin Moyu sent out skeleton god warriors early to explore the path, and the initial feedback he received was that the density of aliens simulated by the formation here must exceed the third level. Moreover, the combat power has also been improved, and the alien intensity simulated by the formation has reached the eighth level of the god king. There is another difference. They built small cities one after another and had the posture of an army. Even Lin Moyu felt that they would use battle formations. Ordinary skeleton god warriors were already difficult to deal with, and Lin Moyu had to send a large number of skeleton god generals to attack. Renhuang Network has stated that the projection has ended, and anything they do here cannot be seen by the outside world. In this case, Lin Moyu has no worries. Tens of thousands of skeleton god generals were dispatched, rampaging all the way, killing people and destroying cities. The token stone tablet, the foreign leader, Lin Moyu didn't intend to let go of any of them. At this level, a few more have to be eliminated. The rules say that whoever kills the alien leader will not only gain the right to directly enter the next level, but will also receive a powerful magic weapon. But by what standards should we judge who killed the alien leader? What state is the alien leader in? Is he the pinnacle of a minor god or a true god? Lin Moyu thought about the rules. If five people attack the foreign leader together, who will be blamed? Is it the first person to take action, the last person to complete the kill, or the person who causes the most damage? The rules haven't made it clear. As long as it's not made clear, there are all kinds of possibilities. To be on the safe side, Lin Moyu thought of a safe way, that is, not to let others come into contact with the alien leader. If he solves it alone, this problem will not exist. At the same time, there is a big difference between whether the power to enter the next level takes effect immediately or whether it can be controlled by himself. He wants to eliminate a few more people on this level. Then you need to get some more tokens. At the same time, he also thought of Zhuangbi Chu Xiong. If he left, Zhuangbi Chu Xiong would probably be in trouble. After thinking about it, Lin Moyu decided to take a two pronged approach. The token must be snatched, and the leader of the Ho clan must also snatch it. As for Chu Xiong Zhuangbi, 
it depends on your fate. I'll help as much as I can, but there's nothing I can do if I can't. After all, it's just a big competition, not a life and death battle. A small city was captured by the skeleton god general, and all the aliens inside were killed, but there is no stone tablet inside. This is also one of the changes. Unlike the third floor, you can see whether there are stone tablets in the tribe from the outside. Now the city must be breached to determine whether there is a stone tablet. In addition, the density of the city here has increased significantly, which greatly increases the difficulty of finding the stone monument. The third level took a little more than a day. The scope of the second level has become smaller, but the time required will increase significantly. It will take at least three or four days. 